Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math. And today we're going to learn about two step inequalities. We're going to solve each inequality and graph its solution. So if I was given this inequality, m minus 3 over 2 is less than or equal to 5. Okay? Well, my first step is I'm going to multiply 2 to both sides. So I multiply both sides by 2, giving me m minus 3 on the left is less than or equal to 5 times 2, which is 10. I then need to add a 3 to both sides opposite of that subtraction, giving me an m by itself on the left is less than or equal to 10 plus 3, which is 13 on the right. And there we have it. We have m is less than or equal to 13 as our final answer. But now we need to graph it. Put a gra uh, line down, or number line, excuse me, down there. And I'll just put a 13 right here. 13, let's go by 1's, 14, so I can fit it, 15, 16. And we have uh, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7. Okay. Well, since m can equal 13, I'm going to put a closed circle right there at 13. And then we need to shade to the left because we said m is less than that 13. So now I have a graph that represents that m is less than or equal to positive 13. So let's recap. We have m minus 3 over 2 is less than or equal to 5. I multiply 2 to both sides, so eliminate it right there. Giving me an m minus 3 on the left is less than or equal to 5 times 2, which is 10 on the right. I added a 3 to both sides, giving me m isolated on the left, and it's less than or equal to 10 plus 3 being 13 on the right. That's my final answer right there, right? m is less than or equal to 13. It's isolated. m is written first. So I have to graph it. I have a closed circle here at 13 because m can equal 13, and my arrow went to the left because m is also less than 13. So I have a graph here that matches my final answer, which is m is less than or equal to positive 13.